Today is the last step in the repaint of our 1987 Cadillac Brome. Pinstriping artist famous Dave Walters from Joliet, Illinois is here to install the stripes on the Brome and make it look just like it did when it was sold by the Cadillac dealer in 1987. Dave starts each job by finding out exactly what you want and asking questions to bring out ideas you may not have even thought of. In our case, we wanted the car to hold true to original and we had vintage photographs of the stripes they installed at Metropolitan Cadillac in Milwaukee when this car was new. Photos in hand, famous Dave is ready to start working. Dave starts by laying out a taped guideline to mark the body line he's going to stripe. Later, Dave will add additional tape lines to keep the main run of stripes perfectly level. Anyone with a little skill can tape and paint a stripe, but Dave's artistry comes through when he has to freehand the spears and details at the end of each panel. In the late 1980s, a typical car would have a dual pinstripe with the top stripe being slightly wider than the bottom stripe. A Cadillac would be a step above with detailed end spears that vary dealer to dealer depending on the stripe artist that dealer used. Our car came with a perforated spear at the end of each panel and a seagull's beak on the front fenders. That's where the tape becomes nothing more than a suggestion and Dave has to freehand the spears. No two cars were ever exactly the same because they were done by an artist who was dealing with lighting, time, weather, and even emotional feelings on that particular day. Once the side of a car is completed, while the paint is still wet, Dave removes the guide tape and goes back to sharpen the lines and soften the ends, giving the stripe that vintage, fresh from the dealer look. When the stripe is finished and the tape is removed, the stripe will be dry to the touch in about an hour. After seven to 10 days, Dave suggests treating the stripe with a good carnauba paste wax. A hand painted stripe isn't cheap, but it isn't the cost of the paint and brushes. You're hiring an artist for a few hours. Famous Dave signs his work with an ace of hearts pierced by a paintbrush. His signature is the same color as the car, so from more than a foot away, it's virtually invisible. But if you know where to look, it's the sign of a personalized piece of artwork that will last for years. Thanks for keeping up with our repaint adventure. If you have any questions about what we did or where to find parts, be sure to reach out to us at westofthelakeclc.com.